at Grand Central to catch the train upstate to see the great jack-o'-lantern blaze. Let's go! jack-o'-lantern blaze at Van Cortlandt Manor. This has been around since 2005 and there are seven over 7,000 pumpkins hand carved here right on the spot. You have to buy your tickets in advance and you have to wear your mask at all times. But let's take a look at all these 7,000 pumpkins. So now we're out of the blaze and it was pretty fun. It was definitely an enjoyable experience. I'm glad I did it. I'm just not so sure if I would do it again. <laughs> it's just, it was a lot more family oriented than I anticipated. There was just a bunch of children and a bunch of like just families, which is cool. But I had hoped it would be more adult themed, which I think I would have enjoyed a lot more. And it's also super crowded, like it's really crowded. Even though you have to buy your tickets ahead of time, it is still kind of pretty crowded, especially if you are paranoid about Corona. But it was a fun experience. I'm glad I got it on video for you to watch. So you don't have to pay $44 to go see this. <laughs> but it was interesting to see just the art and the creativity and the lighting and 
The music was fun also. Anyway, off to the Metro North and home we go. <laughs> train ride and have to take another train after that so I'm pretty tired <laughs> good thing I have battery life right <laughs> joining me and until next time I'll see you Bye.